Hey, what's up? Pure here. here. Uh, today we are actually going to do a battle for Lord of the Rings, uh, the, the gift bundle things. So, got four participants. I'm going to crack these things open. This might take me a minute, so if you fast forward, I completely understand. But if you don't know how the games are played, uh, then, you know, please follow along. So, this is a battle. And we're going to use a couple bundles for this. It's something a little bit different. So inside here, we've got some set packs. I'm going to mix those set packs up, and I'm going to divvy those set packs out. So it's four set packs a person. We're going to add up the mana value of all of their rares and mythics. They get to keep everything in their packs, of course. Whoever has the highest total and whoever has the lowest total is each going to win the little pack with the one ring in it. Oh, and, and the collector pack. <laughs> Forgot, these also had that. Yes, that was part of it. So, that's how this game's going to be played. Essentially, it is a bit, of a, a bit of a high roll, right? That's a pretty good prize for the high and the low. So, I'm going to put that aside. Put that aside. Uh, stupid land pack, stupid land pack. And then, these are the goodies. With These will remain sealed for shipping. Uh, but these have the, the one ring inside of them. Get these. I don't know if I'm going to be able to fit these in the shipping thing, but... All right, let's mix these up a bunch. And this is how the game's played. Well, I kind of already have explained it. So yeah, so we're going to add the mana value of all their rares and mythics. So whoever's a high, whoever's a low, each wins one half of the prize pool. If a tie happens, that will be... Whoever, the, the tiebreaker will be whoever has the single highest casting cost of mythic. And if that doesn't do it, single highest casting cost of rare. And if that doesn't do it, we're going to roll dice. Good. So... We have Matt. Sometimes I, I do believe everybody just wants me to say funny, ridiculous things, and I'm here for it. The Duke Oaks of Sealand. We've got Unholy Ram. And we got Nova. All right, we're going to do this in three rounds. So, Matt, let's get started first with your first two packs. You know what? I'm going to make it two rounds. We're going to do three packs in the first round. Then the tiebreaker pack. All right, so you're going to start with a generous end. Good common to get right off the rip. Okay, our win. Rosie Cotton. Ring Race. Okay, that is a six. Legolas, you're at a nine. Pippin's Bravery and the Ring. I believe the list card's always in the back, right? At least in this non-Japanese printed, I should say. Should I do? Uh, should I do this in one round or two rounds, or two rounds or three rounds? You know what? I'm gonna go back to the three rounds. It's kind of more fun. All right, Matt. Next pack. So we are gonna keep our eyes a little bit on the commons and uncommons. See, this I did shuffle the packs, but those are the same uncommons, which. From my experience, when you're buying um, bundles, is very common. Okay, the Creebane. Mythic. Tom Bomb. All right, so we have our Tom Bomb. That's a 5. And the Doors of Durin. Love the card. That is a 10. And a 10. Pretty good pack. Yeah, we're going to go back to three rounds. So, Matt, you're at a 19. Which is quite a bit out of two packs. Duke. We kick ass Duke. Okay, we got the stone. Bath song. The Grey Havens and the Borderless. Sauron. Okay, the Commander Sauron. That is a big old eight. And there and back again. People were so excited about this one. It's still pretty cool. Uh, that is a 13, the Errant Rider, and a 13. Maybe uh, maybe I underplayed the casting cost of this product. <laughs> All right, next pack for the Duke. Yeah, the Troll and Lorien Revealed. Right there, pack's good. Grima, Lorith. Many partings. Come on, stop sticking together. Ah! <laughs> Duke! You got yourself the one ring. Fantastic. 
Huge hit. That is a four. You're at a 17. I'm gonna sleeve that thing up. The regular pack version. Whew! All right, there you go, Duke. Ram, you are up. So, so Duke, sorry, you're at a 17 if I didn't already say that. So you're at a 17. Rise of the Witch King. All right, Ram. Fell Beast. Vigilas. Come on, come on, stop. The File of Galadriel for a 3. Shadow Summoning and a token. So that is a three to start. Ah, stupid arena token. Yep, nothing advertising card. Okay. All right, come on. What else are we going to get? So we got the Mirror of Gladriel. Legolas in the regular version. Oliphant. Sting in the Borderless. Kind of neat. That is a two. And then Frodo. So that is a three. And then the Vanguard. That feels a little more in line with casting cost I was thinking about. So Ram, you're at a six. Nova. All right. Next pick. Hey, the Mirkwood bets. Okay. Scolding. You cannot pass. Peregrine Took. Sauron. Okay, the rare version. That is a five. Come on, stop sticking. Aragorn, you are at an eight all of a sudden. Rosy Cotton and Foil and a token. Okay, so that is an eight. Next pack. Oops. Yeah. Swamp, spider, and other Mirkwood bats. I did shuffle things. Okay, well, that's how it goes. Gimli, Peregrine Took, <laughs> Boromir, Solid Rare, that's a three. And Miss Sackville Baggins for a six. And I already saw the Cree Bane because I don't know what I was doing. So that's 14. All right, first round. Matt, you're in the high right now at a 19. Duke, you're at a 17. Congrats on the huge hit. Ram, you're in the low at a 6. And Nova's at a 14. Let's do the next pack for everybody, and then we'll see where we're at, and then we'll get into the final. All right, so, Matt, here we go. Hey, Troll and Lorian Revealed, back-to-back. -back. See, that's what I was talking about. I've talked about it in bundles I've opened. The amount of duplication, like if you buy a case of bundles, the amount of duplication is crazy. I don't know how they do the the uh, I don't know how they do the printing or how they pull the packs or it doesn't make any sense to me. Oliphant. All right, here we go. Mythic. Okay, Gandalf. Good Mythic. That's a five. Gimli, and that is a five. Okay. So Matt, you're at a twenty-four. Duke. Do yours. Denethor. The name's just so metal. Hey, Rise of the Witch King. Good uncommon. Samwise. Moria Marauder for a two. And Elrond for a six. And a six it is. This is going to be close for that high. Duke, you're at a 23. Wow. Ram? Hey, I think that might be a list card, finally. Let's see what we get. The list on this product was not a particular stellar list, but you can still get some neat stuff. Oops. I am trying to, trying to straighten up the pile, and I dropped an art card. Here we go. Bitter Downfall, Firebrand, Golem's Bite, Gandalf's Sanction. All right, Borderless Mirkwoods. The Horn of the Mock. For two, Nasty End, and Path of the World Tree from Kaldheim. All right. Well, Ram, you're at a two. So you're at an eight. Uh, you're kind of well on your way here, but we'll see what happens. 
Nova, you're up. Gothmog. Maher. Yeah, like, those feel like orc names. All right, Denethor, many partings. Pippin for a two. Pippin for a two. And Pippin for a two. Okay, last round. We've got Matt, you're in the high right now at a 24. Duke, you're at a 23. Ram, you're in the low at an eight. Nova, you're at a 16. Matt, let's get into your final pack if I could get the thing open. There we go. Wonderful. Good job. Hey, list card. All right. Merkwood Betts. Okay. Stu the Counties. Shire Sheriff. Okay, the, sh the Shire, Shire Sheriff again. The Fall for a three. Ooh, Oliphant and, ah, Benelish Infantry. Not a rare. So that is a three. Hmm. We are at a 27, Matt. Duke. Entish Restoration. Okay. Gimli. Nazgul. Nazi G. Oops. Shelob. Oh, that is a six. Bilbo. And a token. A six puts you at a 29, Duke. You are now in the lead. Ram. All right, another Mirkwood in the Borderless. Forge anew for a three. Okay, Relentless Roar. And a three. Well, that cements the low. So, Ram, you have won the low at an 11. So, going in the final pack, Duke is currently in the high to 29. Nova, you're at a 16. In the end, I'm actually also hoping for another Mythic out of these boxes. So let's do this. Console Deliberation, the Stone, the Bath Song, Nasty End. Come on, stop sticking. Mithril Coat, okay, good rare. That's a three. And Primal Cancun, which is a common. So that is a three, but a good three to finish that up. All right. Final scores, we've got Matt, 27. The Duke, you're at a 29 in the high. Ram, you're at a 11 in the low. And Nova, you're finished at a 19. I'm gonna keep this sealed, but Ram, let's get into your collector pack here. Okay, get past some of these commons and uncommons, but take a look at them. We've got Legolas, the File of Galadriel, Prize Pig, Samwise, all right, come on, Miri, Nasty End, and Frodo, one more. Frodo, ooh, all right. And Duke, congratulations on doubling up. You're definitely the big winner today. But let's see what your prize collector pack has. Forge and New, Goldberry, Trap the Trespassers, okay. Peregrine Took. All right, come on, let's get some. Okay, Reflecting Pool. There we go. That's something. Thank you. So we got Reflecting Pool. Stop sticking together. Lash of the Balrog. And Gandalf. And one more. And Pippin in the Borderless Scene card. 
All right, that's going to do it, folks. Um, essentially, these these uh, these list bundles ended up out there uh, for a, a pretty good price. So, you know, I thought it would be fun to do a, a bundle battle. Don't really get to do that, and this felt like the, the right time and a place to do it. Um, thankfully, we had some good mythics that came out of it, so that's that's a good time. Thank you, everybody, for watching out there. Like, comment, and subscribing, and all the good stuff that you guys do to make sure that YouTube channels uh, still go. Um, and But beyond that, uh, patrons appreciate you guys still want to even do this kind of stuff. So, till tomorrow. Bye.